My name is Pat Doherty and I'm the inventor of the freewheel wheelchair attachment. I'm also a C67 quad and I use my freewheel every day. For over four years we've been distributing freewheels to over 40 countries and we've heard some great stories of how it's changed people's lives. We also get questions. Can I use my freewheel on my folding wheelchair? Well now the answer is yes. I'm pleased to be able to provide the freewheel folding wheelchair adapter. I can't wait to hear your stories and see pictures of places you can now explore using your freewheel. This adapter setup guide video will take you through the steps to set up your freewheel and the adapter. First step is to set up the straight shim on your freewheel and insert the shim into the silver brick on your freewheel. Step two in setting up the freewheel is to take the shortest rear end and using an Allen wrench, screw the rear end into the brick. Do not tighten all the way. Leave about a quarter inch gap between the rear end and the black shim. You will finish tightening it once it is attached to the adapter hitch. This next step involves taking the freewheel and clamping it onto the hitch. Install the freewheel onto the hitch and close the handle of the freewheel. Once it is secure, turn the hitch over and insert the Allen wrench into the hole at the bottom of the hitch and finish tightening the rear end. The connection should be nice and secure. Now remove the freewheel from the hitch before the next step. You will now be putting the adapter together and setting it up for your wheelchair. This section of the video shows how you separate the two tubes and slide the hitch onto the tubing. In step two, unscrew the large knobs on the tubing and remove the tube shim on each end. These should be clipped onto your wheelchair frame. The tube shim has a slight notch at the end to make it easier for you to clip them onto your wheelchair frame. Slide the shim as far back as you can on the frame tubing. Once these are on, you will never need to take them off. The clips are designed for 1 inch tubing. For inch and an eighth diameter tubing, no clip is required. Lifting one end of the adapter, line the clamp up with the tube shim and close the clamp over the top of the wheelchair frame tubing. Now lift the knob into the slot and tighten. Repeat this step with the other side. Make sure each knob is securely tightened. You are now ready to attach the freewheel to the adapter hitch. Put the freewheel into the tail dragger position and then lifting the hitch, clamp on the freewheel. When it is done, you will want to make sure the freewheel and the hitch are centered in relation to your wheelchair. We have found that if you slightly elevate the front casters of your wheelchair about a quarter inch prior to this next step, you do not need to adjust the angle of the freewheel. This final step of setting up your adapter secures the hitch at the correct angle so your freewheel works properly. Using the Allen wrench, start by slightly tightening all four screws across the top of the clamp. You want to avoid completely tightening just one screw at a time, rather tighten them all a little at a time. You will want to tighten all four screws as tightly as you can. For you engineers out there, we suggest 20 foot-pounds torque. This is the final step in setting up your adapter. Sit in your wheelchair and rotate the tire under the freewheel frame. The front casters will now be lifted off the ground. Always start in the tail dragger position when you put on or take off the freewheel. You are now ready to go. Thank you again for choosing the freewheel and the folding chair adapter. Now get out there and get freewheeling.